The Iron Man Legacy, Robert Downey Jr.'s Marvel Journey Born April 4, 1965, Manhattan, New York City, New York, USA Birth Name Robert John Downey Jr., Nicknames Bobar DJ Height 5 foot 8, 1.73 m Robert Downey Jr. has evolved into one of the most respected actors in Hollywood. With an amazing list of credits to his name, he has managed to stay new and fresh even after over four decades in the business. Downey was born April 4, 1965 in Manhattan, New York, the son of writer, director, and filmographer Robert Downey Sr. and actress Elsie Downey, née Elsie and Ford. Robert's father is of half-Lithuanian Jewish, one-quarter Hungarian Jewish, and one-quarter Irish, descent, while Robert's mother was of English, Scottish, German, and Swiss-German ancestry. Robert and his sister, Alison Downey, were immersed in film and the performing arts from a very young age, leading Downey Jr. to study at the Stage Door Manor Performing Arts Training Center in upstate New York, before moving to California with his father following his parents' 1978 divorce. In 1982, he dropped out of Santa Monica High School to pursue acting full-time. Downey Sr. himself a drug addict, exposed his son to drugs at a very early age, and Downey Jr. would go on to struggle with abuse for decades. Downey Jr. made his debut as an actor at the age of five in the film Pound, 1970, written and directed by his father, Robert Downey Sr. He built his film repertoire throughout the 1980s and 1990s with roles in Tough Turf. 1985, Weird Science, 1985, True Believer, 1989, and Wonder Boys, 2000, among many others. In 1992, Downey received an Academy Award nomination and won the BAFTA, British Academy Award, for Best Actor for his performance in the title role of Chaplin, 1992. In Robert Altman's Short Cuts, 1993, he appeared as an aspiring film makeup artist whose best friend commits murder. In Oliver Stone's Natural Born Killers, 1994, with Woody Harrelson and Juliette Lewis, Downey starred as a tabloid TV journalist who exploits a murderous couple's killing spree to boost his ratings. For the comedy Heart and Souls, 1993, Downey starred as a young man with a special relationship with four ghosts. In 1995, Downey starred in Restoration, 1995, with Hugh Grant, Meg Ryan and Ian McKellen, directed by Michael Hoffman. Also that year, he starred in Richard III, 1995, in which he appears opposite his Restoration, 1995, co-star McKellen. In 1997, Downey was seen in Robert Altman's The Gingerbread Man, 1998, alongside Kenneth Branagh, Daryl Hannah and M. Beth Davids, in One Night Stand. 1997, directed by Mike Figgis and starring Wesley Snipes and Nastasia Kinski, and in Hugo Pool, 1997, directed by his father, Robert Downey Sr. and starring Sean Penn and Patrick Dempsey. In September of 1999, Downey appeared in Black and White, 1999, written and directed by James Tuback, along with Ben Stiller, Elijah Wood, Gabby Hoffman, Brooke Shields and Claudia Schiffer. In January of 1999, he starred with Annette Bening and Aidan Quinn in In Dreams, 1999, directed by Neil Jordan. In 2000, Downey co-starred with Michael Douglas and Tobey Maguire in Wonder Boys, 2000, directed by Curtis Hansen. In this dramatic comedy, Downey played the role of a bisexual literary agent. In 2001, Downey made his primetime television debut when he joined the cast of the Fox TV series Ally McBeal, 1997, as attorney Larry Paul. For this role, he won the Golden Globe Award for Best Performance by an Actor in a Supporting Role in a Series, Miniseries, or Motion Picture Made for Television, as well as the Screen Actors Guild Award for Outstanding Performance by a Male in a Comedy Series. In addition, Downey was nominated for an Emmy for Outstanding Supporting Actor. In a Comedy Series the actor's drug-related problems escalated from 1996 to 2001, leading to arrests, rehab visits and incarcerations, and he was eventually fired from Ally McBeal, 1997. Emerging clean and sober in 2003, Downey Jr. began to rebuild his career. 
he marked his debut into music with his debut album, titled The Futurist, on the Sony Classics label on November 23, 2004. The album's eight original songs, that Downey wrote, and his two musical numbers debuting as cover songs revealed his sultry singing voice and his musical talents. Downey displayed his versatility in two different films in October 2003, the musical-slash-drama The Singing Detective, 2003, a remake of the BBC hit of the same name, and the thriller Gothica, 2003, starring Halle Berry and Penelope Cruz. Downey starred in powerful yet humbling roles inspired by real-life accounts of some of history's most precious-kept secrets, including Richard Linklater's A Scanner Darkly, 2006, in 2006 co-starring Keanu Reeves, Winona Ryder and Woody Harrelson, and Fur, An Imaginary Portrait of Diane Arbus, 2006, co-starring Nicole Kidman, a film inspired by the life of Diane Arbus, the revered photographer whose images captured attention in the early 1960s. These roles exhibited Downey's momentum from the previous year of 2005, in which he starred in the Academy Award-nominated feature film Good Night and Good Luck. 2005, directed by George Clooney and in Shane Black's action comedy Kiss Kiss Bang Bang, 2005, co-starring Val Kilmer. In 2007, he co-starred in David Fincher's Suspenseful Zodiac, 2007, alongside Jake Gyllenhaal and Mark Ruffalo, about the notorious serial killer who haunted San Francisco during the 1970s. In Robert Altman's Short Cuts, 1993, he appeared as an aspiring film makeup artist whose best friend commits murder. In Oliver Stone's Natural Born Killers, 1994, with Woody Harrelson and Juliette Lewis, Downey starred as a tabloid TV journalist who exploits a murderous couple's killing spree to boost his ratings. For the comedy Heart and Souls, 1993, Downey starred as a young man with a special relationship with four ghosts. In 1995, Downey starred in Restoration, 1995, with Hugh Grant, Meg Ryan and Ian McKellen, directed by Michael Hoffman. Also that year, he starred in Richard III, 1995, in which he appears opposite his Restoration, 1995, co-star McKellen. In 1997, Downey was seen in Robert Altman's The Gingerbread Man, 1998, alongside Kenneth Branagh, Daryl Hannah and M. Beth Davids, in One Night Stand, 1997 directed by Mike Figgis and starring Wesley Snipes and Nastasia Kinski, and in Hugo Poole, 1997, directed by his father, Robert Downey Sr. and starring Sean Penn and Patrick Dempsey. In September of 1999, Downey appeared in Black and White, 1999, written and directed by James Tuback, along with Ben Stiller, Elijah Wood, Gabby Hoffman, Brooke Shields and Claudia Schiffer. In January of 1999, he starred with Annette Bening and Aidan Quinn in In Dreams, 1999, directed by Neil Jordan. In 2000, Downey co-starred with Michael Douglas and Tobey Maguire in Wonder Boys, 2000, directed by Curtis Hansen. In this dramatic comedy, Downey played the role of a bisexual literary agent. In 2001, Downey made his primetime television debut when he joined the cast of the Fox TV series Ally McBeal, 1997, as attorney Larry Paul. For this role, he won the Golden Globe Award for Best Performance by an Actor in a Supporting Role in a Series, Miniseries, or Motion Picture Made for Television, as well as the Screen Actors Guild Award for Outstanding Performance by a Male in a Comedy Series. The actor's drug-related problems escalated from 1996 to 2001, leading to arrests, rehab visits and incarcerations, and he was eventually fired from Ally McBeal, 1997. Emerging clean and sober in 2003, Downey Jr. began to rebuild his career. He marked his debut into music with his debut album, titled The Futurist, on the Sony Classics label on November 23, 2004. The album's eight original songs, that Downey wrote, and his two musical numbers debuting as cover songs revealed his sultry singing voice and his musical talents. Downey displayed his versatility in two different films in October 2003 the musical-slash-drama The Singing Detective, 2003, a remake of the BBC hit of the same name, and the thriller Gothica, 2003, starring Halle Berry and Penelope Cruz. Downey starred in powerful yet humbling roles inspired by real-life accounts of some of history's most precious-kept secrets, including Richard Linklater's A Scanner Darkly, 2006, 
in 2006 co-starring Keanu Reeves, Winona Ryder and Woody Harrelson, and Fur, An Imaginary Portrait of Diane Arbus, 2006, co-starring Nicole Kidman, a film inspired by the life of Diane Arbus, the revered photographer whose images captured attention in the early 1960s. These roles exhibited Downey's momentum from the previous year of 2005, in which he starred in the Academy Award-nominated feature film Good Night and Good Luck. 2005, directed by George Clooney and in Shane Black's action comedy Kiss Kiss Bang Bang, 2005, co-starring Val Kilmer. In 2007, he co-starred in David Fincher's Suspenseful Zodiac, 2007, alongside Jake Gyllenhaal and Mark Ruffalo, about the notorious serial killer who haunted San Francisco during the 1970s. In May 2008, Downey achieved critical acclaim and worldwide box office success for his starring role in Iron Man, 2008, John Favreau's big-screen rendering of the Marvel comic book superhero. The film co-starred Gwyneth Paltrow, Jeff Bridges, and Terrence Howard. In August of 2008, Downey starred with Ben Stiller and Jack Black in the comedy Tropic Thunder, 2008, and went on to receive an Academy Award nomination for Best Supporting Actor for his, Kirk Lazarus. In December 2009, Downey starred in the action-adventure Sherlock Holmes, 2009. The film, directed by Guy Ritchie, co-starred Jude Law and Rachel McAdams and earned Downey a Golden Globe for Best Performance by an Actor in a Motion Picture, Comedy or Musical in January of 2010. In early summer 2010, Downey reteamed with director John Favreau and reprised his role as Tony Stark slash Iron Man in the hugely successful sequel to the original film, Iron Man 2, 2010, starring Gwyneth Paltrow, Scarlett Johansson, Samuel L. Jackson, and Mickey Rourke. Downey next starred in Due Date, 2010, a comedy directed by Todd Phillips, in which he plays the role of an expectant father on a road trip racing to get back in time for the birth of his first child. Due Date, 2010, starring The Hangover, 2009, as Zach Galifianakis, was released in November 2010. Downey was honored by Time Magazine's Time 100 in 2008, an annual list of the 100 most influential people in the world. His laurels include two Academy Award nominations, three Golden Globe wins, numerous other award nominations and wins, and tremendous popular and commercial success, particularly in his roles as Sherlock Holmes and Tony Stark, the latter of which he has so far played in Iron Man, 2008, Iron Man 2, 2010, The Avengers, 2012, Iron Man 3, 2013, and Avengers, Age of Ultron, 2015. For three consecutive years, from 2012 to 2015, Downey has topped the Forbes list of Hollywood's highest paid actors, making an estimated $80 million in earnings between June 2014 and June 2015. In 2005, Downey Jr. married Susan Downey, with whom he has two children. Downey also has another son, Indio Falconer Downey, born 1993, from his first marriage to Deborah Falconer, from whom he was officially divorced in 2004. Robert has jump-started the Teen Downey production company with his wife Susan Downey. Family Spouses Susan Downey, August 27, 2005, present, two children. Deborah Falconer, May 29, 1992, to April 26, 2004, divorced, one child. Children Indio Falconer Downey Avery Roll Downey Exton Elias Downey Parents Robert Downey Sr. Elsie Downey Laura Ernst Relatives Allison Downey, Sibling Trademarks Sarcastic humorous deliveries while remaining completely stone-faced Distinctive drawling voice Frequently plays egotistical but likable scoundrels Frequently plays intelligent but eccentric characters Trivia during the promotion of Avengers, Age of Ultron, 2015, famously walked out of an interview with Krishnan Gurumurthy when pressed about his dark past because he felt it was inappropriate that children would be watching. He told Howard Stern he would leave again if that ever happened in the future, according to an interview he gave to Newsweek in February 2009, when Downey went to Japan for their opening of Iron Man, 2008. 
he was detained on entry because Japanese authorities ran his passport and found it linked to some incredible criminal activity, namely Downey's multiple arrests and incarcerations on drug-related charges in the 1990s and 2000s. For failing to disclose these convictions, Downey was interrogated for six hours and was almost barred from entry into Japan. It was finally decided that he could enter Japan for the Iron Man premiere, but he is never to be allowed into Japan again. Was a huge fan of the Iron Man comics as a child. Sting, Every Breath You Take, and Billy Idol performed at his wedding to Susan Downey. At the age of 10, while living in London, Robert attended the Perry House School in Chelsea and studied classical ballet. Salaries Oppenheimer, 2023 $4 million, plus back-end participation. Doolittle, 2020, $20 million. Avengers, Endgame, 2019, $75 million. Avengers, Infinity War, 2018, $75 million. Spider-Man, Homecoming, 2017, $15 million. Iron Man 3, 2013, $50 million. The Avengers, 2012, $50 million, once box office bonuses and back-end compensation are factored in. Sherlock Holmes, A Game of Shadows, 2011, $15 million. Due Date, 2010, $12 million. Iron Man 2, 2010, $10 million. Sherlock Holmes, 2009, $9 million. Iron Man, 2008, $5 million. Game 6, 2005, $100 slash day. Danger Zone, 1996, $500,000. Richard III, 1995, $50,000. Only You, 1994, $2 million. <laughs>